Hey guys, welcome back to part 4 of Undertale. On the last episode, we met Sans and Papyrus, and they are amazing. And, <laughs> I mean, that's, that's, that's all that needs to be said. Um, so let, let's continue on. It says, this is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Use the box. I mean, I don't really have anything to put in it. What's this? Tough glove. Instead of tough love, I get it. Oh. Oh, ice cap struts into view. Uh, compliment. Uniform ice cap that has a great hat. My hat's too loud for me to hear you. Whoa. Ice cap also wants a hat for its nose. Uniform ice cap that has a great hat. Duh! Who doesn't know? Oh. I just gotta make sure its hat is still there. Um, uh, compliment. I said it has a gray hat. My hat's too loud for me to hear you. Hmm. That's not what I meant. It's snowing dandruff. Alright, I'm gonna steal it. You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. I knew it, thief! Uh oh, he's mad. This one's easy. I said also wants a hat for its nose. I don't have a hat. I have a glove. No, I don't want to fight. I feel like that might ruin my pacifist run. Ignore. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Hello? My hat's up here. Ice Cap is secretly checking if you're looking at his hat. Nope, ignore. Continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. Seems defeated. Fine, I don't care. Yeah, I got this. Is desperate for attention. Spare. Haha, <laughs> ignored. No. No! That's not what I want to do. Yes, use the box. Alright. What can I do with these? Like, toy knife. You equip the toy knife. No. Uh, item. Okay, it's bandage. Equip tough glove. I see, so yeah, I got armor and attack. Faded ribbon. Faded ribbon, armor, defense 3. If you're cuter, monsters won't hit you as hard. That's true. Alright, let me just check all these items really quick. Bandage heals 10 HP. It has already been used several times. Uh oh, okay. Toy knife. Weapon attack 3, made of plastic. A rarity nowadays. And stick. Okay. So let's get equip that toy knife. Tough glove, weapon. Oh, okay. Tough glove's the way to go. Although it doesn't really matter since I'm a pacifist. That is not what I meant to press. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, use. Okay. Now I can move on. Let me save really quick. Does saving restore your health? Do I have health now? Oh, I do. Good. So save points are health stations as well. Oh, hey, it's them. Let me go up first. Oh. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Sure. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. Aw. But I want to call. There's Toriel. Aw, oh, nobody picked up. You send the line back out. But I want to call. I'll send it back out so somebody else can see it. Alright, here we go. So, as I was saying about Undyne... <laughs> He's freaking out. San! 
humans. Oh my god, is that a human? I hope I'm giving Pappers the same voice I was earlier. Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Uh oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god, is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undyne will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! 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 Ahem. <laughs> Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Oh man, Brick from One Piece would get along with these guys so well. Oh yeah, this guy. Alright, I know what to do with you. Uh oh, looks annoyed. Oh, I'm so sorry. I was actually thinking about giving Papyrus the Brook's voice, but... I'm kind of trying to speak like how their voice lines are because um, like Sans has like the bleh, bleh. so I'm trying to talk like a, hey what's up and then you know Papyrus has got like I don't know, it's got a weird noise so I'm trying to like talk like this with Papyrus so eh, you know I, but I could always talk like this says Papyrus not that I have any vocal cords <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I tried. Alright, can I show you? Or spare you? Can I show you? Show you what? There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. I'm gonna build this, you panda. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, it's not yet a very famous royal guardsman. Alright, so Pappas wants to be a royal guard. I can respect that. Absolutely no moving. Does not do anything for me. I tried. Oh no. Oh no, who's this? Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Doggo. Whoa. Shifty. Those shifty eyes. Mmm. Pet. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, oh, what? Moving, moving. Doggo is confirming the moving object. Pet. I was suspicious of your movements. It moved. It did not move. Oh. Ah. I'm not good at this. Doggo six attack. Easily excited by movement. Hobbies include squirrels. Oh boy. Son of a bib. Uh, pet. Too suspicious. Alright. I gotta focus. Which way is it going? Are you serious? Oh! Oh man, I'm an idiot. Don't move. I'm not supposed to move my heart. I got this now. And no wonder he was always tracking me down because I was moving. I am an idiot. <laughs> That's so cool. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Pet. You pet Doggo. What? I've been pet. Pot, pet, pet, pot, pet, pot. Doggo has been pet. Oh, I can spare him. Let's do that. You won! Something pet me! Something that isn't m moving! I'm gonna need some dog treats for this! And I'm gonna need a save point for this because you took a lot out of me. You son of a bitch! He is a son of a bitch because he's a dog! Uh oh. Oh, lesser dog! Oh, so cute! Whoa. Check. Lesser dog, attack 7, wields a stone dogger. Made of Palmer granite. Pant pants. Oh, so cute. Whoa. 
Let's see what you're trying to do. Pet. You barely lifted your hand unless your dog got excited. <laughs> Tiny bark. Oh. Oh. So if it's blue, that means I don't have to move, I think. Alright, spare. There we go. Oh, zero gold. Alright, that's fine. I gotta get health. Convenience of that lamp, yep. Alright. And I have full health? Good. Oh, this guy. Ignore. Yep, yep, yep. Sorry, buddy. It was cool the first time, but yeah. Definitely gonna ignore you. Fine, I don't care. Sorry. Already seen it a million times, not cool anymore. Ice cap is just for attention. Oh, are you? Well, I'm gonna ignore you and walk away. Bye. Alright. Let's move onwards. Uh, this guy. <sighs> How did I do this again? Hmm. Choke. I... I'm just gonna run away. I don't wanna deal with him. His, uh, his, what's the word? Combination. It's hard for me to remember. Uh oh. Hello? Is anybody there? No? I guess not. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Alright. Yo, what's up? Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Yeah, that's what I figured. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a sign, stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. <laughs> Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. <laughs> it's in yellow. That's great. Ah, uh, yes. The infamous ice poke puzzle in every... Most RPG games. North ice, south ice, west ice, east, Snowden town, and ice. Let's go to ice. Oh. Yep. Get easy money on this guy. Yeah, I'm really liking this game so far. I can see why so many people like it. I mean, those those two skeletons, they are quite the bunch. Mmm, yep. Ignore again. Alright. And... Out. Now let's go check this out. Oh hey, it's a snowman. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please. Take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. How am I doing? By I, I mean the piece of me I gave you. Alrighty. Let's go this way to the town. You're so lazy! You are napping all night! I think that's called... sleeping. Excuses, excuses! Oh-ho! The human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. This hurts my voice. Okay, you can go ahead now. Oh. Sans! What did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. <laughs> Mmm. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. Oh, I was gonna go around. Alright. Incredible! You slippery snail! You solved it so easily. Too easily. However... The next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I might have to change his voice because this is really hurting. I know I am. 
Nye <laughs> Oh. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yes, he is. Whoa. I understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold, sure. Here you go, have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. Nice cream, it's the frozen tree that warms your heart. Nah, I'm good. Well then, tell your friends. There's ice cream out in the middle of the woods. It's cold, why would you want ice cream with this weather? Whoa. So it's a soccer puzzle? Oh hey, what's up? I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Sure. Did I say five gold? I meant fifty gold. Alright. Really? How about five hundred? Five thousand gold? Five thousand gold. That's my final offer. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. <laughs> Good. Great. Oh, this thing reset. Alright. Soccer time. Wee. Whoa. Uh, get over here. Push you down. I see, I see. Whoa. Not gonna go on the ice. There we go. It's golf. Green, your concern and care for ball led you to a delicious victory. You're awarded one gold. Yes. Nice, nice puzzle sounds. Uh, no. You're right. I should charge way more than that. Alright, on to the next one. Oh. His. His? Hers? Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman. White rating. Can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy. Blue rating. Smell of rolling around. Word smell. Humans. Green rating. Destroy at all costs. Uh. Alright. Where do I go now? Uh, can I just drop down this hole? Oh, I can just go over here. Looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow... Snow decahedron? Huh. Cool. Human! I hope you're ready for... Sons! Where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Monster Kids Word Search. Oh no. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Oh jeez. Do I have to do anything? <laughs> uh, do I use my mouse? Uh, no. It's not saying anything. Sans! That didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumbo is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude? What? Really, dude? That easy peasy word scramble? What's for baby bones? Ugh. Believable. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Well, I've never played Jumble, so... I think crosswords are pretty hard. You two are weird! Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snort! <coughs> oh, man. <clears throat> Might have to change his voice. <laughs> I haven't talked in like a specific voice in this amount of time. In case you guys didn't know, actually you guys don't know, uh, I'm recording this episode right after episode 3. So, still a little sore from last episode and it's not helping I'm doing it this time too. Pepperus finds difficulty in interesting places. 
This is where he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. I mean, like, sounds voice is easy to do, it's simple. Oh, hey, save point. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, <laughs> it fills you with determination. Good. Alright. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed again by the great Papyrus. <laughs> Papyrus. Mouse. I hear the mouse. It's an unplugged microwave. All the settings say spaghetti. Hmm. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. Huh. I guess I can't eat it if it's frozen. Alright, onward. Warning, dog marriage. Oh god. What's that mean? Oh. Clear the snow. Whoa. Sighing, Jerry. Oh, jeez. Nor. Jerry eyes from ice cap. It looks annoyed. Ice ones are snow problem. Shh, I'm thinking, guys. Oh, Jesus, they're tax mix. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. What hit me? Norm again. Why are we doing this? What a fail. Whoa. Oh, that one almost hit me. Somebody is smiling at its own bad joke. Well, I am going to spare him. Why are we doing this? What a fail. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Alright. Uh, laugh. Laugh at Cedric's fun. See, laughs. Dad was wrong. Kasai. Okay. Sorry, I'm just focusing. I'm just pleased with this cool joke. Now I can spare him. So, like, what are you even doing? Jerry lets out a yawn. Ditch. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. Oh, but I killed the other monsters. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Darn, I should have done that first. Uh. This is weird. So there's like an X right here. It's yeah, it's like some sort of map. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. I gotta go over here. What's with the dog marriage sign? <sighs> what do you want from me? There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. There we go. Easy peasy. And this way. Uh, yep. Yeah, there we go. Uh oh. Whoa. Oh. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If your smell, identify yourself. Oh. Hmm. Here's that weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Doggy. Oh, it's a dog marriage. Oh no. Uh, dog and me. Resniff. Dog sniff you again. But you smell just as weird as before. Hmm, what's that smell? Smell mystery. Smell mystery. Whoa. What? Oh my gosh. Darn, it's just too suspicious of your smell. Stop, don't touch her. Beware of dog. The dogs are saying sickly sweet things to each other. Especially your smell. Oh, Jesus. At least this attack's easy to avoid. Other one, not so much. Roll around? You're a roll around in the dirt and snow. 
You smell like a weird puppy. Don't touch my hot dog. He means me. <laughs> oh, the dodges. Still got hurt. Awesome. The dogs want to resmell you. The dogs sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell alright. What? Smells like a... Are you actually a little puppy? I can't... Uh, I don't know how to dodge that one. Well, son of a bit. Tittle, stay determined. Oh. Alright. Well, I think that's a good stopping point. I'll figure out the deal with those guys later. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you on the next video, which will be part 5 of Undertale. See ya!